Singapore Deputy Prime Minister Teo Chi Hien says the white paper on population represents a major shift in the way the country grows its labor force. He was speaking at the groundbreaking ceremony of the Home Team Tactical Center today. Acknowledging concerns about citizens about the projected population growth to 6.9 million by 2030, Mr. Teo, who is also Minister in Charge of Population Policies, said the white paper focuses on the interests and benefits of Singaporeans. He explained that the government had actually worked out two scenarios and struck a balance between the two. The first scenario is to freeze at where Singapore is today. That means the workforce will shrink sharply as the population ages. At the other extreme, continue what's been done for the past 30 years. That is, grow the workforce at about 3.3% a year. This, Mr. Teo said, will put very serious constraints on the country. The decision, he said, was to go midway, half the workforce growth rate up to 2030, and beyond that, bring it down further to 1%. So indeed, we are not going to grow as fast as we used to. Over the last 30 years, um, growth has typically been in the 6 to 7% range. Going ahead, you will see growth come down to about uh, 3% up to 2020, but high quality growth, and beyond that, 2020 to 2030, we will see 2 to 3 percent growth. So it's a very different uh, growth pattern compared to previous years. And uh, what we are looking for then is high quality, productivity driven growth, which will bring good lives, good jobs to Singaporeans.